Got a little, got a little death flavor on it. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. A little bit of death juice just has that touch of umami that the house needs. So, the, the fact that somebody died upstairs is like a little funky, but then, um, there's also the fact that the attic was boarded up. So like, um. There's like a single room in the attic, which has like a bathroom and everything. It's like plumbed three piece bathroom. And it was, they just boarded it up. There's no way to enter it. You, we would need to take out a wall to access it. Uh, and it still has a bed in it. That's like the beginnings of a horror movie. Yeah. So the downstairs tenant, there's, uh, there's tenants upstairs and down. There's an old lady downstairs who's lived there 11 years. And, uh, and she said that he, the, the dead person, uh, is often in the house. So there's that. Um, there's a, there's a corner of her apartment, uh, that she says is a cold spot as well. Um, hey, thank you for the follow, Master Chef. I appreciate that. Can I visit? I'd prefer not to sleep in the attic, please. Yeah, that's understandable. Maybe he's not dead, just squatting. <laughs> You're just like, you know what? Prices are super fucked. I'm going to fake my own death. And then just like move shit around upstairs all the time. You know, rattle things around a little bit now and then. Tell the ghost, can you not? <laughs> ghost, could you don't? Yeah, apparently the uh, the drug growers and and uh, and dealers who live on the upstairs though, who have the attic attached to their uh, their suite, uh, have never seen the ghost. Um, I say uh, drug growers and sellers because there's a little shed out back uh, that has marijuana plants in and around it, and also uh, when we were doing the walkthrough with the inspector. Uh, they had boxes filled with uh, quarter pound bags of marijuana. Um, but they they haven't seen the ghost, so. Well, which way will it be? I feel like you should have bartered a bit harder. <laughs> Barter harder too, the bartering. Um, we will probably offer, like we'll probably um, right before closing. Apparently. A thing you can you can do some people sometimes do is offer like just sort of say hey now that we've done the inspection here's a few things we saw that we're not like wild about and um, you know we were wondering if we could just knock like five grand or whatever off the purchase price and apparently that can that can help sometimes so we're gonna try that be like hey you know what uh, we didn't know a person died upstairs, nor that he still uh, haunts the place, nor that there's a weird boarded up bedroom, uh, nor that the electrical is a little on the janky side. So, um, can we uh, maybe knock five grand off the price? That'll let us uh, Don't rush. Place your feet carefully. hire uh, an exorcist and an electrician. <laughs> 